Tony, Tony right Tony. now yeah. as a chance for everybody to get their first look at Boy Tony. Here he is. Hello. You people will remember me as Tony Falk. But Tony Falk died one night at a rock concert in St. Petersburg, Florida. And boy, Tony was born. Now, you people remember, Tony Falk didn't win very many wrestling matches. But boy, Tony wins nine out of every ten matches. Now, I want to take some time to explain this to you. Now, you be good. And I'm going to tell you how it all happened. See, it goes like this. One night, I said, I'm going to go to this concert to see Boy George. And while I was there, he noticed that I was out there, and he stopped everything and announced that we had a great wrestler in the audience. And I stood up, and everybody gave me a round of applause and I sat back down but after the show boy sent someone out to tell me to come backstage that he wanted to talk to me and what boy George wanted to tell me is he told me Tony you've got to quit trying to be like everybody else copying their styles and their moves and you just got to be yourself and when you do everything is gonna happen for you so from that day on I just started being myself I dressed the way I I wanted to dress, I walked the way I wanted to walk, and I talked the way I wanted to talk, and I was successful. So I went back to Boy George, and I talked to him, and I said, you know, this has changed my life so much that I want, from this day on, to be known as Boy Tony. And Boy George and I became such good friends, he asked me would I help him with his special projects. I went with him to help on the Farm Aid, the Live Aid concerts. I went to Hollywood with him, and I met a lot of his friends. And I thought that it was really nice that Boy George was helping those poor farmers and those people over in Africa. And I thought it would be wonderful if I could do something for the wrestling fans, to clean up these wrestling fans, because you know some of them are pretty nasty. They need soap, they need toothpaste, and I said that I'm gonna raise money. We even, boy, even said he would help me with the concert to raise money for these wrestling fans. Now my special project is gonna be called Fan Aid. Now I told Boy George it wasn't good enough just raising money and buying things and sending them over there to Africa because them Africans didn't know how to use them. But see, I'm gonna take time and teach these people, these fans, how to use deodorant and how to use toothbrush and toothpaste and how to shampoo your hair properly. I'm gonna show everybody how to use these things properly. Each week, I'm going to have my own Boy Tony hygiene tip of the week right here. So if you will follow me now into my powder room, I will show you the first tip of the week. Now I'm going to have to put this microphone down right now, and I'll talk real loud so you can hear me. Now, I want you people to go and get in front of the mirror, and I want you to smile real big right now. Just go ahead, go ahead, smile. Now, you see all that green stuff and that brown stuff between your teeth? That's not supposed to be there. And boy, Tony is going to teach you how to get it off right now. First of all, you need a toothbrush and some toothpaste. Now, all you do is you take the cap off, and you squeeze a little bit. Not too much. You don't want to be wasteful. Put the cap back on the toothpaste. Now, that's a no-no to leave the cap off. Never do that. Okay, now, take the toothbrush with the toothpaste, run a little water, and stick it under there just for a moment, and then take the toothbrush with the toothpaste and just scrub up and down. There you go. Up and down. All around. Oh, yeah, just watch me, boys and girls. Just like this. Now, at first, you will have a little problem with your gums starting to bleed just a little bit. But that's no problem because after a while, your gums will get used to that. But you've got to get that green stuff off of them teeth. And just keep scrubbing up and down and all around. And after you get finished, take a little water. 
and rinse out your mouth and then you can have a big white beautiful smile like boy Tony has. Now I want you to be sure to join me next week for another boy Tony hygiene tip. Thank you.